Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna to show you how I keep my skin glowing and hydrated all throughout summer, so let's get into it. So the first step is going to be to remove any makeup that I have on. I don't currently have on any, but I decided to go through the motions and show you. I'm using the Lancome by Facil Makeup Remover. I think it's supposed to be for eye makeup, but I use it all over my face. Next, I'm going in with my Youth to the People Superfood Cleanser. I've been using this for a very long time now, and I just use this on my Clinique cleansing brush, and I'm going to make sure I thoroughly cleanse my face. Now, if I were to have on makeup, I would do a double cleanse, but like I said, since I don't, I am just gonna stick with that one cleanse. Now, a life hack that I discovered probably well over a year ago are these Clean Skin Club Clean Towels. They're actually disposable face towels. That way you don't harbor any bacteria or anything, and they actually do a really good job of thoroughly cleansing the skin. I like to get mine really wet when I am rinsing off any cleanser that I have on my face. Now, if you're not new to my channel, you will know that I love Murad's peels. Um, I used to use a different one, but I decided to try this one, so this is the Daily Clarifying Peel. I feel like it really does just help to slough off any dead skin cells to leave the skin really bright, glowing, hydrated. I have been obsessed with this one. Now, speaking of newest obsessions, this is going to be the Drunk Elephant A Passioni Retinol Cream. Now, I love this one and I love retinol because I feel like it really does help with like fine lines, brightness, all of that. The only thing is, it does not smell good, but it's amazing. It just kind of stinks. Now, this Admire My Skin Ultra Potent Brightening Serum has kojic acid, lactic acid, vitamin C, and salicylic acid for dark spots. So, I just apply it to my darker areas with a Q tip. This is a very strong product, so I definitely would recommend using a test patch first. The eye cream I've been using lately is the Volition Helix AM PM Eye Gel. I especially love this product because that gel formula really just helps to smooth the under eye, and I think it wears really great under makeup. This Marc Jacobs Youth Quake is everything. I have been obsessed with this every summer, I swear to God, it is great. It is super hydrating, but because it also is that gel kind of a texture, it absorbs really quickly, but I feel like it doesn't leave the skin greasy at all. Y'all, I literally don't know if I have anything bad to say about this, other than if you don't have it, that's not great. Next, I go in with the CEO Glow Vitamin C Turmeric Face Oil from Sunday Riley. I love this one just to seal in all of that moisture that we added, and I just love that additional glow. And of course, when you're using any kind of brightening products, you want to make sure you use a great SPF. I have been using the Neutrogena Ultra Sheer 60 Plus Sunscreen, and in addition to it being fragrance-free and having vitamin E, I find that it doesn't leave a white cast at all, and I have been loving this, loving this, <laughs> loving this. In addition to my face, I like to put this on the back of my hands, my neck, and then my decollete to finish. So that has been my skincare routine, you guys. I think it is great for summer, and these have been all the products that I've been obsessed with. I'll see you in the next video.